Anthony, look what I've got, Mr. Louis. Come on, come on up, Snoops. And I got something for you, bowl of goldfish. Look, put him right here, Mr. Hornsby. No. About eight in there, I think. Come on, be uh, right back like that. I am dying, and she's bringing the animals. Did you see the papers? Yes, I saw the headlines. It says that certain party is stuttering. And every time he's stuttering, I am tittering. Oh, did something happen to your hotel, Mr. Louis? Oh, if he's in the soup, the hotel Louis is blowing. Oh, who's in the soup? The certain party that give you the sables. What sables? My dear young lady, we're all alone. Will you please cut the tragedy? But I haven't got any sables. I am trying to give you my friendship. And she plays poos around the corner. What is this? A horse? No, Smarty, it's Kalinsky. Me and you both. Well, if you don't believe me, ask, ask uh, Mr. Van Buren. <clears throat> well, if it's uh, just the same to you, I'd rather remain on the sidelines. He's the one who told me. Well, if, if, if this is sable... He must have made a mistake. You, 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 you wouldn't give a sable coat to a stranger, would you? Uh, who, me? Never. Ah! Uh, uh, what, what was the name of the gentleman that helped you order my supper last night? Too far is enough. The imperial suit for one buck a day with breakfast, one egg, I don't mention. The bottle of woolly, 1919, guinea pigs, hunky dory, but... When you tell me that you don't even know the name of J.B. Ball, my dear young... Do you mean to tell me that that, that, that old gentleman is J.B. Ball? Mm -hmm. And you thought I took a sable coat from him? Mm -hmm. Come on, Snoopy! Mm. Come on, Mr. Hornby! Get out from where you Put that back on the icebox. Such a humiliation. Oh, that's terrible. What do you suppose made it crash?